Hello, Hockington Middle School, and welcome to another HMS Today. I'm your host, Eve Weatherhead. Today, we've got a puppet show book talk for you, but we'll start off with an interview segment. I'm Olivia. I'm in sixth grade, and some of my friends are La Ow. <laughs> Larry, um, well, um, two other people, go, Let's Nicole go. and Rachel. Okay. I like um, mm, volleyball. I'm good at talking. I talk a lot. <laughs> One time, like, I was, like, walking, and I, like, couldn't hold up in the door, so then someone else held it open for me. I like to play board games. My favorite book is The Giving Tree. When I was little, um, my mom used to tell me that when I lied, I had black speckles on my tongue. That was great, and thank you for your time. If anyone else out there wants to share, you know where to find us. And now, let's go to another segment of the magnificent Puppet Show Book Talk. Hello again. I'm still here in the book nook, working my way through my 40 book challenge. Mm-hmm. Lately, though, I've been feeling a little mm, boxed in. Do you ever feel that way? Mm -hmm. Well, maybe it's just me. Well, I have discovered that if I pick up a good book, it transports me to a new time and place. For example, I'm reading a book called Trell right now. It's so fascinating. It's about a 13-year-old girl named Trell who takes a bus ride every Sunday to visit her father in prison. See, the police think he murdered someone and sent him to prison for life. Ooh when Trell was just a baby. But Trell doesn't believe it and becomes friends with a journalist who helps her dig into the truth while facing their own possible murders and um, <clears throat> a corrupt system. The best part about this book is that it is set in Boston and based on a true story. Read Trell by Dick Lair to help you understand the world around you without ever having to leave your room. Or maybe that's just my problem. Hmm. Now, let's see who gets birthday wishes. Roll the scroll. <music> Happy birthday, everybody. If you haven't found our Have You Seen This location or answered our online poll, you've still got one week left. So check those out. And everything else at hms.today and send us your thoughts to hmstv at hillers.org. Until next week, be nice. But, oh, sorry, I did it for you. Cheer, he spelled share wrong. And thanks, and thank you for your time out there wants to share. You, <laughs> sorry, I'm sorry. Puppet show talk, wait, that's not it. I have a beautiful room. At each get out of here. Still got one leak week. I was alright. <laughs>